I think the biggest influence on me when I was a kid was my big brother, Del. He was eight years older than me, and he went off to uni when I was 10 years old and just starting to get into music. And he used to send me mixtapes with all the stuff that he was listening to at university. So it was stuff like Joy Division, New Order, The Pogues and stuff like that. So I actually had quite different tastes from what a lot of my friends at school did uh, because I was influenced and in trying to follow what my big brother listened to. I would still say that my favorite group is The Pogues uh, because there was a time in my life when they were my favorite band and I would listen to them completely obsessively. And one of the first gigs I ever went to was called The Pogues in the park and they played in a tent in Finsbury Park on a very wet rainy day and I can remember coming home from this concert having like just basically jumped up and down in mud from two hours and just being completely like caked from head to toe in mud and it was one of the most fun things I can ever remember happening when I was a teenager. In terms of things that I listened to when I was a kid that I'm embarrassed by. It's actually really interesting because if you'd asked me like when I was like 19 or 20, like the fact that when I was nine or 10, I used to like listening to ABBA, I would have said, oh my God, that's so embarrassing. Like don't admit that I listen to ABBA. But the funny thing about things being cool is, is it goes in circles. And now it's actually pretty cool and funny to say that you like ABBA again. And I'm happy to admit that as well as like in rock music and stuff like that, I like ABBA. And unlike when I'm a teenager, I can actually say it without being embarrassed or ashamed of myself. A friend of mine came and stayed with me for a while over Christmas and she was playing this song by this DJ called Timmy Trumpet and it's called Freaks and it's like been in my head for the entire year and it's driving me completely insane but I still can't stop playing it because it's just like going round and round in my head and driving me completely balmy so that seems to be what I'm listening to most at the moment. I never actually listen to music when I'm writing. It's funny that I find writing is actually quite intense and you really need to concentrate and you need sort of peace and quiet and no distractions. I do listen to music when, um, when I'm doing boring things like my accounts or when I'm answering my fan letters, but there's something about writing that just very specifically, I just need to concentrate and completely focus on the story and I can't just have music banging away in the background. Were the bands in Rock War inspired by a particular band? I don't really think so because they're kind of kids and they're young and very much at the start of the series um, they're forming these bands and they're coming along and although I've planned out the story arc and I know what's going to happen when you write a book there's a lot of stuff that develops so maybe as the series goes on I'll kind of get more of an idea of what these bands sound like in my head but right now because I'm still fairly early in writing the series I haven't really got a clear idea of who these kids are and what their music is like. <laughs>